go get your favorite brew and enjoy this next video with me. Welcome back here to the shop. We have another little tool restoration. It's nothing drastic on this one. I just want to clean it up and it's kind of a unique tool. It's a pickaxe and this is a very good quality pickaxe. It's got a nice spike here on the bottom. We'll take a look at it is made. Let's see what's it called? Whole bore made in Austria. If you look, it's a Stubai. And if you'll remember, those of you who watched it, we did this fence tool and it is the same brand, Stubai. So let's take and clean this up. It has a little bit of rustic discoloration here. I want to get that cleaned up. There's nothing really that's to be too sharp on it. It's an ice pick but it really is from all my research a very good quality one let's clean it up and get it a place up on the wall Here's our pickaxe all cleaned up. We basically just took off the rust here, tried to clean it up as best as I could. It is a really nice tool. You can see the three pins there that hold this in. This all inserts into the wood and the wood sandwiches this frame here to give it some strength. It's just a really nice tool. So again, as we mentioned at the beginning, it's Dubai. It's got this nice spike on the end to hook into dirt and ice and snow. I sanded the handle. It's nice and smooth, but you can still see all the character marks. The friend that I bought this from used to go hunting in Colorado, and he would take this all through the mountains and so he used it heavily let's get this thing on here this just goes up like this and then there is a hole right here to put a screw to help hold that wrist band on and it slides up and down the shaft so this friend of mine used to go all over Colorado with it, and it has all of the marks from him being all over the place. He used it as a walking cane to help himself up hills, sticking this into the dirt, and helped him get around there in the mountains. This here, the sheath, the cover, the mask was getting a little cracked right there. I've treated the whole thing with mink oil we'll probably put another coat of mink oil especially there on that area that slides in like that and then this gets torqued over hard to cover this bladed scoop that goes in there and then there's this rubber tip that goes here on the end to keep it from hurting anybody while i camp and not in use so thanks so much for joining me on this project cleaning up this nice quality tool got a place for it up here on the wall hang it right there and it will be there as part of the trophy on the wall so thanks again 
Have a great day. God bless. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe, share with a friend. Hope to see you on the next video.